Hey folks, it's been quite a few months since the last time I did a YouTube video, <clears throat> but um, I wanted to show you what I've been doing lately. I know the previous video was showing some of the wood crafts and wood carvings that I did, and I've been continuing to practice and study and improve and I have just completed see if I can get it on the screen here a Rebec a 12th century predecessor to the violin and this is a four stringer Trying to get some of the nice detail that I've got in here. The, the bridge and the arch. And the tailstock. It's round, pear-shaped on the base. And I even put together a nice primitive bow. Uh, this is not your standard bow. It's something that I kind of improvised with uh, cotton knitting yarn. But I think it will do serve its purposes for the demonstration. Now, I will not pretend that I know anything at all about playing the violin. I just want you to hear the tonal quality of this instrument while it's being played. no means an expert in how to play the violin. But I think it has a wonderful sound to it. It's considerably loud. I'm not modifying the audio in any way on this video. As you can hear, I'm talking around it over it. It's making this with, like I said, a rather garbage bow. Anybody that plays the violin or stringed instruments will tell you that if I had a proper um, synthetic bow strap or the horsehair, I would probably get a lot better quality sound out of this instrument. Now your traditional Rebec, what you will normally find out on the market has three strings and I went a little non-traditional but I could not see myself throwing away a violin string simply because it was not in use so I've configured this Rebic to be four strings so anybody that is familiar with playing a violin should have no trouble picking up this instrument and being able to play it very similar. 
by now the way a rabbit is held is cradled in the arm like this it's not it's not put up underneath the chin it's just cradled in the arm like this and bowed quite proud of my abilities here. It, it took a fair amount of training, research, you know, the ability for me to be self-taught in being able to do something like this. And this is my first efforts. I have others that I'm planning on doing in the future and with everything naturally, uh, I fully expect that the quality will get better. But I'm quite happy with this one. This is this is very nice. It's made out of one piece solid cherry wood, and the tailstock, the bridge, and the fingerboard are carved out of black walnut. I just wanted to share that with you folks to let you know that I am still around, but I'm occupied at the moment. I'm not so focused at the moment on doing YouTube videos. And uh, depending on the response that I get, I could be encouraged to showing up on a little more occasion, but it's not a big priority for me. Thank you for watching, and may God bless you abundantly.